I'm here at Vijay Raghava Road in Tinagar and uh, just to give you a sense of uh, the situation here, uh, this is what uh, uh, the road uh, looks like. Uh, uh, according to the locals, they say that uh, the water levels uh, had increased uh, uh, because it was continuously raining but now uh, it has uh, receded and uh, they are hoping that uh, uh, the corporation will uh, uh, step in and uh, will uh, drain this water uh, from this locality but this is one of uh, the usual places where uh, 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 you know water logging is reported uh, whenever it rains uh, uh, despite uh, uh, you know corporation uh, putting an effort to build storm water drains uh, nothing seems to have happened uh, here at uh, uh, Vijay Raghava Road in fact uh, these are the vehicles uh, that have been uh, parked here and uh, uh, just to uh, tell you uh, you know the vehicles that you see there uh, they were uh, parked, uh, you know, uh, on this road, but uh, because uh, the water levels were extremely high yesterday, because it was continuously raining, all these vehicles were uh, pushed to the other side. Uh, this is what uh, the locals are telling us. And uh, uh, the white uh, uh, vehicle, uh, uh, you know, the white uh, BMW vehicle has been parked on this, row, uh, on this road uh, since uh, day before yesterday night because it got stuck. Uh, uh, day before yesterday and that vehicle is still there in the middle of the road. Uh, so this is how uh, uh, things are uh, in this particular locality in Tinagar. In fact, uh, there have been, uh, uh, you know, the locals have been trying to, uh, uh, you know, set, set up this road because the barricades uh, on this road have all fallen uh, and there is also a hospital here. Uh, so uh, the locals here are uh, pitching in at this point in time and trying to help uh, uh, these people but uh, uh, clearly uh, the situation uh, uh, in Tinagar in West Mambalam uh, remains grim as usual because of uh, uh, water logging and because of uh, uh, you know the kind of uh, inconvenience that people have faced uh, uh, since yesterday a lot of uh, SOS calls uh, went unanswered is what uh, uh, a lot of uh, residents are complaining because they say that uh, they have been trying to reach out to the Chennai Corporation but uh, there has been no response but uh, according to Chennai Corporation they say that uh, they have uh, uh, you know uh, kept their teams on standby because they cannot carry out relief and rescue measures when it is raining very badly from uh, last night uh, uh, immediately after the rain stopped uh, the restoration work is being carried out at different places uh, uh, priority is given to ensure that people uh, uh, who are living in low-lying areas are brought to uh, safer locations and uh, also uh, if uh, uh, in case uh, uh, people need to be evacuated uh, that is a process that uh, uh, the corporation and uh, the other civic authorities are looking at uh, at this point in time but in most of the places uh, uh, the main roads are clear but the interior roads uh, there is still water logging that is being reported uh, and uh, uh, as far as main roads are concerned uh, uh, in most of the arterial roads uh, uh, the Chennai Corporation has placed uh, 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 giant motor pumps uh, to ensure that uh, water is pumped out and uh, 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 the place is open for traffic, uh, the road is open for traffic. Uh, so uh, this is what uh, the situation looks like at this point in time.